Hey everyone, welcome to the Gamers Grimoire and welcome to uh something I'm extremely dis like I'm it, it's I'm hyped but disappointed. He just wanted a controller support. Which to be fair though, it definitely could have had it given how the controls kinda move. You right. just kinda you would have Right just, analog sticks right there, man. I know that's what I mean. The right <laughs> analog sticks. So this is a project made by the fans. Uh hopefully this doesn't get taken down. Hopefully we don't get copyright striked for putting out any content on this. So uh, my net missions is done by a bunch of fans. This is the Metroid Prime one. D make into 2D, or I guess the, remake the, as a 2D. The uh, good Metroid Prime. What's up? The good Metroid Prime. Echoes isn't bad. It's not great, but it's not bad. Three is fucking terrible, and we don't talk about other M. <laughs> it's we not, we don't that, talk about other. Other M's M. that a prime game. <laughs> I understand that, but we don't talk about. Other and I'd M rather either. play other M than two and three. Any day of the week. At least Sorry, other M still plays like a Metroid game. Like uh, yeah, three did. Three was like hampered because it had Wii controls. Actually, the Wii controls were not that bad. No, but like the game would not be difficult if those controls weren't like wouldn't. And it wasn't even difficult per se. Regardless, it's just losing auto lock and losing oh. like, and like the the like whatever. No, lo lock on was still a function in the game. Um, it's just the tracking wasn't the same though. Yeah, well, yeah, because you get the fuck because you have to get used. At, at that yeah, point, yeah, I gotta pull my Wii mo. I yeah, gotta immersion. It's, 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 I get it's, that. It's not even that. It's just at that point, it's just look, look. Are your arms steady? No. Well, then I'm sorry. You're going to have a rough time, buddy. Yeah. Uh, one thing we'll say, let me move this back, too. Uh, vision by Andreas Sod Soderberg. 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 All right. So, I mean, uh, I loved Zero Mission. Oh, that's my And uh, that's my this game has... That's my favorite Metroid game. The aesthetics of this are, like, so pleasing to the eye. Can I skip you? No. Yes, I can. Don't do skip it. Oh, it's, we have to right. We have to see ourselves landing. You're right. It's part of the part of the game. And look how much effort they put into literally the background already. And it's um, just pixels. It's, it's just pixels. Yeah, it's it's actually really impressive. It, like if you it, saw this, it, this would have blown my fucking mind. All right. As like so a kid. you know what this looks like? Actually, this looks like someone actually painted like all those strokes right there. You see that looks like actual like someone mm -hmm. did that in like fucking like in an art program, and then. All the stars are obviously pixelated. Mm -hmm. uh, look, look at all the 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 asteroids. Oh man, I will say this: uh, Metroid is near and dear to both of us. Ye. I know you play the fuck out of it. Ye. Um, I remember Metroid Prime being like the game I played the most. I think on the GameCube. Ye. Um, I lost my copy. And I was really sad. I think we still have ours for one somewhere in this fucking apartment. Um. Man, you know what I really loved about Metroid Prime 1? What? The demo for it, allowing you to have, like, the freeze beam really early. Uh, Did you ever play the demo? I remember playing the demo a lot at Walmart. <laughs> in, the, in the demo, you had uh, Prime 2D. Hey, Ridley. Oh, uh, we got the speed racer you, you know going what, on. You know what? I'll say this. At least they didn't use any pre-existing assets for Ridley's voice. So, like, it seems like nothing about this is, like... Yeah, this is this is a love, uh, love you know, a craft of like, love from the fans. We um, still have heard fuck all about Metroid Prime Three. You mean four? Yeah, four. You're right. <laughs> okay, but um, been... and the re where I was going with that statement, by the way, um, did you ever play the Metroid Two remake, the fan made re Metroid Two remake? No, I know I heard about it. I remember seeing it on like, so a essentially Kotaku the thing Metro or whatever. All right, all right, so essentially, um. AM2R was literally Metroid 2 for the Game Boy reimagined as like a Game Boy Advance game. So it used a lot of like the Game Boy Advance assets. Mm -hmm. So I can see why Nintendo did the whole season assist, whereas this is literally just all hand fucking made. Like, right, yeah, look at that. Look at, look at that. It's so good. Oh, I can't go this way. This is an invisible wall. Oh, wait. No. Oh no! There was just like there was just something in the way. Yeah, hey, you gotta jump, buddy. We don't have it. We don't have our charge beam. But like, just one of the things I will say is, uh, the controls feel so good, and there is actually like the way that Samus's arm moves. Yeah, based on like the mouse uh, cursor, it's 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 actually really cool. And like, this is why like, I will say this: uh, if you've got like an auto clicker, you can do like retarded like actually just shoot a bunch. It looks go, like they're limited. Go, go, to, like, go to the right first, buddy. Yeah, I know. We need to go. Oh, the, oh, I forgot what was the, the button for scanning. Um, uh, right click, I think. No, there's like a. You have to enter a mode for it. I remember oh, it. Oh. I, did, I did fuck around with it, with it for a bit when I did right, the so test. 
Oh yeah, they. She, I think she has the wall cling. No, no, uh, we we, we, we power, unlock the wall cling. You talking about the the power grip? Yeah. You know what? This is a safe station. No, that's a map station. It it's not working because you're in a demo. Feels bad. <laughs> Plus, there's not much you can really do about you we know. Don't the, get, we don't get the morph ball yet either. Nope. I don't think we even get that in the demo. No, you do. Nice. Try seeing if you can scan now. So right click doesn't work. No. What about Fair. what about hitting uh? There's a button. What about Q? Do. It is Q. Oh yeah, and then it's then it's right click to scan. Yep. So in the first Metroid Prime, I remember just being obsessed with this. I don't know why. What the and scan it, thing? Yeah. With the scan oh. budget. Yeah. Um. I thought it was interesting. Well, no, okay. So, like, when I was a kid, when I was a kid, and I played it, I was like, "That's fucking stupid. This, this is dumb." I, I thought it was so I, cool. I, I hate it. And then I got older, and I was like, "Yeah, this is actually pretty fucking dope." But man, like, if if you're a completionist, I'm sorry. I am sorry. Because you have to scan everything. You, do. you really do have to scan everything, especially in Prime One. Uh, even in the other games, everything. Like right now, scan that. Yeah. God, that, why is that taking so long? You're like right there in front of it. New entry to the uh, artifact temple. Titan uh, info decryptifying or decrypting space pirate journal. The temple we discover is clearly of the Chozo design. How do they make it float like this? We had to install this bridge just to access it. <laughs> Mine crew X6 was unable to bore through the stone here, and some of that team said that they had seen a similar stone back in the. Oh, it was the Zebesian ruins? Yeah, because yep. this is Zebes, right? Uh, what's, the well, planet? No. what's the name of this planet you again? Are, you are... Uh, I don't think you're on planet Zebes. Uh, yeah, Zebes. That, because Zebes is what? That's the uh, the Chozo homeland. I, I want to say right. you're on Talon 4. Yeah, I think this is Talon 4, yeah. That, 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 I believe that was the whole purpose of, uh, of one. And then the Luminoths or whatever have their own fucking weird planet. Yep. Oh, yeah, I forgot. There's actually... We already have the wall jump. Well, yeah, wall jump's always been a thing in the 2D Metro games. It's just whether or not you're good just at doing go it. Just go over, like, just, like, yeah, how good the they... the amount of detail they put into Oh, yeah, this, this is so... <laughs> we can just get the look. <laughs> Why not? Because that's a glass wall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck, dude, this looks better than, like... So many of the fucking handheld games. Oh, yeah, these eventually are... Oh, you think they, they turn on. You've got to scan, like, all of these. Because it's just, like, you know, going to the actual Chozo ruins. Yep. Um, fucking, I mean, like... The Chozo artifacts. Yeah, oh, man. Fucking artifacts. Can we get the power grip now. Power up achieved. Ow, my ear. Okay. Okay. <laughs> and, uh, and now it indicates that, there, that 12 artifacts are needed to activate the temple. Yeah, to fight fucking Mecha Ridley. Yep, and then after that, to fight Metroid Prime. Yeah. Rogue data has attached itself to your suit. Yeah, I have to do it for all Pirate, of these. Power grip. No, I mean, you don't have to scan those. But not just, I mean, it's a demo. I was like, oh, yeah. We're at a completion, Adrian, though. For when this ever gets fully released. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nintendo will be like, somebody trying to use well, RIP? Mm -hmm. Okay, see, the thing is, all right, so the thing is about these fan remakes, like, these fan projects and these little passion projects, like, obviously, I'm in the boat where it's just like, yeah, do them. Yeah. This is awesome. That's fucking do it. Just if you're gonna do it, don't make a buzz about it. And what I mean by that is like, don't put yourself out there going, "Yeah, we're doing this," so yeah, that way yeah, everyone so like can fucking, fucking cease know. And cease and desist. Because the moment, you know, you know, it's not, it's not necessarily their fire. It's also you know the fanfare that you end up with um, from well, the, people online. Yeah, and that's that, that leads to my next thing. But, but the reason why I'm saying like, hey, like you know, kind of you know, shut up, is because like eventually it's gonna get covered by like some fucking game journalist on a fucking website like Kotaku or some shit like yeah, that. Yeah, exactly. And then from there it from there it takes off from it, it's just it's just a domino effect at that point. Yeah. You, you need missiles, bud. I know. And that's just to get an expansion for your missiles. Yep. And you can't even go that way. Wait. wait. Oh, look at it bounces back. Can it hit you? Okay, no, it can't. Oh. I, was like, I was like, can you hurt yourself though? All right. Away we go. Um, the pacing, the, the atmosphere, and the fact that it's got, you know what's weird? The fact that it's got the entire lookout of, like, the visor 
Which is kind of a little weird, given the fact that we're not at a uh, you know yeah, a yeah. first person perspective. It's yeah, a little but, odd, but but it like, is it is really nice to see it, the, the entire the, love and feel of it. It's just for the sake of the HUD. Yeah, because I mean, like is, it, the HUD is the, the HUD for Metroid Prime has always been attractive. Um, scan that. I do. And this gives HP. Yep. I don't have the charge shot to suck it in though. Yep. <laughs> Funny enough, I remember pl uh, playing uh, Metro 2 Remake, and like they actually had that effect where if you use the charge beam, it'll actually uh, uh, pull in uh, items. Yeah. Yeah, it's just it's like you save heal it. Yeah. Look, to save this very short demo, we're also gonna heal though. Did you get hurt? I did. Ah. The seedling shot me. Ah, I was right. at 84. All right, let's proceed on to the Chozo Ruins. Hooray! Oh man, I remember these boys. Oh wow, they're really fast. Yeah, they, they lunge like they're just like dumb though. <laughs> I mean, you gotta know what these just, are. Just like in the fucking Genki game. Yeah, dude. Well, in the Genki, they just do this like weird little like shuffle, like they shuffle up and right. Oh and god, I remember these. The things that blow up. I remember walking near it when I was when I shot sack. it the first time. Zap sack. Explosion. Kaboom. Oh, I like how it just went into the water. That, that's nice. Yeah, the fact that it falls into the. Uh, yeah, look, look, at those oh, splash, the, look at those fucking splash effects. Oh, this is a poison mushroom. Yeah, the blast caps. Ah. Oh, yep, I walked on this, top of it this time. It, you could just jump over it. Exactly. Oh, hey. Zoomer. Everyone's favorite little spiky boys. Zoomers. I like uh, Barry's. Uh, yeah. Yeah. His little. I, I, uh, I, knew, I knew that's what this was yeah, going the, the Yeah, the fucking. The, his little artwork of uh, the Zoomers. Yep. Oh, whoa. Whoa. Fuck. This is the, the founder. founder. Actually... Interpreting embedded Chozo glyphs. We Chozo have reached the apex of understanding. This reality holds no secret to us. In this f in this plight, we have brought great prosperity to the universe and discord alike. A console was formed to determine what would be the fate of our species. Our next step to enlightenment. The elders and seers communed with each other in vain. A matter so precious could not be so easily decided. Oh shit, there's more. It was then that he came to us. The one we would call the founder. Although he was juvenile, his words of wisdom were not bound by such things. And so we all listened as he spoke of a world of great forests, deep pits of fire, and tall mounds of ice. Wait, is he, is he just talking about Talon 4? Yeah, he is. <laughs> Because you got the area with like the shigats and the yeah. bits of fire. Fucking all right, and then to build one last great city on the world he described, return to the simplicity of nature from which we came. Only then could we achieve the true understanding of this universe. And so we chose yep. out, departed to our final home, Talon, Talon, Talon Four. Four. Nice. That's kind of cool. I wasn't. Oh, the fuck! There's more in my head things. <laughs> A ground depiction of Chozo leader features a grid of conductive wires. Oh, that's like the fucking Protoss. Or I guess the Protoss would be based off the Chozo at that point. Given that, uh, uh, what's called called? Uh, Metroid came first. Uh, possibly, yeah, possibly an air terminal for redirecting electrostatic discharge. Weak energy signals flicker from within. Now indicates that the apparatus is operating at 17% of its ideal capacity. Mm, cool. Oh, that light! What the fuck? That's so cool. Uh, it's it's breakable. stone. It's breakable. Aha! It with probably, a power bomb. Uh, there wasn't even any power bombs in fuck. Wait, no, yes, wait. Was no, there? I think power. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's power. I, it's yeah, been there's power so bombs. long since I fucking yeah, there's played power, there, there's, there's power bomb. There's power bombs. Oh my god, the lifts. Yep. Transport to Chozo Ruins West has been activated. Ah, uh, yes, that that music. Yeah, that's what from I'm certain like... from certain angles. A pattern of gro uh, of grooves can be seen in this stone. The inner clay has a seventy three percent increase in acoustically reflective attributes relative to the outer surface. Oh, I was supposed to scan one more thing. I was supposed to scan one, but I can do it when I get upstairs. Eh, don't worry about it. Yeah, not like it's necessary. It's, it's just gonna tell you, like, yeah, this is this the is a, this is a fucking elevator. This is the elevator that leads to each other's ruins. So cool. You're gonna scan that. Yep. Step into the hologram. <laughs> Step into the hologram. 
Oh. Oh, whoa. Wait, no, I need, wait, no. Ow. Need you. Tell me your secrets. <laughs> Beetle. Beetle. This species of hexapod insect is capable of piercing through solid materials with its crustacean-like beak. Despite its hyp hypogen nature, it possesses wings which uh, facilitate lateral speed and altitude gain up upon subterranean eruption. Talon beetles are not ordinarily aggressive. Environmental abnormal abnormalities yeah, are most likely the cause of their current unnatural behavior. In other words, phase on. Yeah. I was like, come on, John, platforming. You can do it. Ooh. Ooh. That's lore. Lore. Teach Chozo me. lore. Scan with the Chozo face right there. New entry the library. Go golden age. Interpreting embedded Chozo glyphs. Upon reaching our promised home, a golden age of peace and prosperity would manifest. Many a Chozo sought to uh, contribute to the great city envisioned by the founder. Those who could not were insured 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 solace until the time of enlightenment the word spread quickly among us mm. <laughs> mm. Uh, of the virtue of the founder and his aspirations despite being one of us he was revered as if he were more you were more in our folly we met we we the chozo sought to imitate him in ventures that would ultimately lead to failure we would soon be rejuvenated however as it is during this time, the founder would begin to manifest his vision. He chose one to be by his side, one without whom this the, the founder could, could not, not succeed. succeed. The guardian. guardian. Sneak. Oh shit! What up? Surprise attack. That's the that, power ball. That's the morph morph bomb. That's the morph ball. By the way. And why is it there of all places? Oh, ah, oh, ah man, my, fav my favorite enemy of all time. War wasp. War these wasp. aggressive insects are the solitary warriors of the nest. When a hive is threatened, it expedites the development from the larval stage to mature warrior. In a matter of seconds in combat, these wasps will unfold their wings and abdomen to appear larger and intimidate their prey. The stinger is unable to pierce your suit's armor, but the acidic venom still poses an acute threat. On uh, impact. impact, yeah. Uh, you know what? I hope we run into my most like the the enemy I hate the most because I think it's the dumbest. What? Suicide bats. Oh, the screechers. Yes. Oh, you need the you need the 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 missiles to blow up their nest. That's right. Yes, you do. I forgot. All of this is yeah. Just just leave. You're you're not gonna, right. you're not gonna make any headway here. Oh, those scammers. Oh yeah, right. The eyeball boys. Ions. A bulbous exoskeleton surrounds a complex muscular tissue. Its nucleus can charge energy and focus a stimulated emission that burns or vaporizes its targets. This larval. Di what? Diorumu? Diorumu. Uh, I didn't even get to read what the word was after that. It has not yet reached its warm like adulthood and is highly sensitive to seismic vibrations. Any nearby movement will trigger its defensive state. But a con concussive blast will temporarily overwhelm its senses. Fuck off, idiot! So in oh. other words, yeah. shoot him in the face. Shoot, shoot him in the eye. That's right. And then once you get the charge shot, which I don't think is in the demo, you can actually just kill these fuckers. Yeah. Or lower. Ow! Not now, beetle. I need to learn. Wow, do the back do the backgrounds in this game look fucking amazing? The, the rebirth. rebirth. The, arch the architect of his and the architect and his followers could not come to an un unified a unified god i i don't like the font i don't like the font either uh, to a unified conclusion and once again the third guardian would be deserted through unshakable per persistence he would continue building a second architect would approach the guardian who would now become known as the final guardian however the final guardian was not convic convinced by this architect's plight immediately you would need to medi uh, meditate. Yeah, I know. Trust me, I thought it was mediate too for a second. Meditate upon it further. 
You know it's weird? Yeah. Cause uh, they, yeah. Pot, oh my god. Look at look at the little thing. All right, so like, yeah, it's a, it's a skull. Oh yeah. Upon having made his decision, the final guardian sought a long lost ally. Oh uh, shit. Thanks, my John. bad. I, I didn't realize that. Uh, keep holding and it you down. went you went. Fuck. One deeper right. than before. Right, stop. Stop. All right, we're there. Fuck. Uh. Upon having made the decision to call upon. Believing it. Uh, thanks. Oh, my bad. <laughs> uh, there we go. You are bad at this. <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry. Be believing it to be the right time to call upon him. Next. Okay. <laughs> the Harbinger initially refused the call to aid his uh, his friend. Also believing the great city to be a lost cause. He, however, remembered his vow to him and could not break it. Interesting. Another one. I didn't even notice you were on the ground. I shot you out. Leave me alone. Yeet. Can you go up there? Uh, or, probably. We, have the, we do have the power grip. Oh. It's more so can you make... Okay, you can't yeah. make the jump. Uh, go to the door below first. Uh, oh, my God. Oh, look at the mirror reflection. In the I know, on the, on the ground. Oh, save point. Nice. You can scan this, by the way. Oh, and Q just activates it. Why oh, not yet? Oh. It heals you. I regret this. Game not saved. Okay. But I need to know what you do. Oh, wow. A save station. What do you do? <laughs> <laughs> I already know. The embedded glass panel emits light rays through phosphor lining. A low frequency electromagnetic signal can be traced to the matching device on the opposite wall. It appears to be used to use incoming photons as both visual data and uh, photovol uh, vo photovoltaic or yeah, photovoltaic energy. All right. Yeah, I guess it's Q to activate. Yeah, cool. Save the game, even though we're already approaching the end anyway. Uh, not, not entirely. Fine, I'm not speed running. This. Ah. I mean, we, we're taking our sweet time. Yeah, you gotta take it in every. You know, gotta take in the surroundings, dude. Leave me alone. Can I go over there? I'm sure you can, but the hive's in the way. Shit, yes, fucking. Like, you things. can try. Oh god! Oh, All right, fine. fine. Fuck you, boys. Boss. Oh, oh are these? these guys. Yeah, scarabs. scarabs. These territorial beetles prefer to live in dark isolation, but they will swarm together if a collective threat is perceived. Their emergent behavior as a super organism. Super, <laughs> super organism. Yep. Uh, that's a term. Uh, attempts to coat the invader with its acidic residues. Recent environmental toxins have made this poison more hazardous. Yep. So, so fun fact: this this means they have the same behavior as um, certain um, what's it called? Uh, certain uh, I can't think of the term. Uh, there are caterpillars that will, that will do this. Oh. 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 Are you really gonna sit here and try to kill every last one of them? I want this help though. I, you're, I was like, bro, you're taking way more damage than you That's are gaining health. Fine, fine, fine. <laughs> Leave me alone. Hey, I think I know what room we're about at the end. Uh, which to your right? Oh, that's fine. Oh, oh yeah. god! So that's like the worst. Oh. I love how I say what's to your right, and you keep going left. You know, it's like the opposite of like every other game I've played. <sighs> Ow. It's on the opposite side of the safe station. Oh, no, another map station. Jesus, that. Age of Silence. Oh, that's lore. Okay. For many years, would the third guardian pers uh, persevere? Slowly, he would make progress, even if it fell upon deaf ears and blind eyes. We, cho we the Chozo, were blessed to see his most recent creation, but we were not yet invigorated. Having suffered so much loss and betrayal, more years of silence followed as the work of the third guardian continued. It is during this time that we would record all of the past events. It is an effort to document the history of the city. His solitude would continue until a new architect came to reunite some of us in the building the city. The architect and his followers ultimately decided it would be better to abandon the work of the third guardian and start anew once again. Dude, these guys seem like they're like the worst multitaskers of all fucking time. Are the Chozo are like, dude, we're not like we're halfway done. Fuck it. Just abandon the project. It's like, fuck it. That guy's a heathen. Yeah, dude, he's a heathen. He doesn't believe in the great work. 
fucking leave me alone. Hey. Oh, the little flutter bugs. Why is mine? This winged insect's uh, this winged insect's metabolism uses endothermic rea uh, reactions to store and transmit heat. Its thorax is home to myriads of strains of bio bioluminescent bio uh, yeah, bioluminescent bacteria, which expel trace of amounts of gaseous chemicals. No acute threat is detected from plasmids, but effects of long-term exposure are unknown. You will get cancer from this. I wanted it to be dark. Ugh. Oh, you can break those. Aha! Uh -huh. Great. Comic Galactic Technology for containing various materials. Bah! We'll blast them. Oh, look, you guys have health. Oh, you can also push them, too. That's kind of cool. They have physics. Oh, fuck! It's dark! Yeah, it is. I hope you're ready, bud. Oh, wait, I remember this room. Is this where I'm going to get attacked by a bajillion fucking uh, wasps and, like, little guys? Yep. Da, 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 da. Holy shit, this looks cool as fuck. Yeah, then the room fills with acid, right? Yeah, I do remember this. In the zone. Oh, God. Yep. Waspy yep. boys. Yep. Yep. Get ready, get ready to mash that button. Yeah. Nice. Here they come. Yeah, it's like you fire at it. Uh, yep. And now it's gonna release another swarm of bees. Keep firing, just keep firing, just keep firing. So anyway, I started blast. Yeah, like literally, it's just oh no. So anyways, <laughs> oh here they come. What the oh, fuck is? What, what kind of Medusa pattern is that? <laughs> nah, it's 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 bro, you're playing Doctor Kong Country. Talk oh yeah, you're right. Blast! Open your mouth. Tell me your secrets. Eat the lemons. All right, let's keep firing. You got this, bro. This is my lemon you. custard. Uh, oh uh, yeah, I was like, I was like, don't change, don't change your aim, don't change your like Whoa. in this situation, just keep firing forward. Oh hello! Could you imagine if that many wasps were just like in front of you? Uh, I'd rather I'd, not. I'd no. I'd rather no. never fucking no. imagine this many wasps in front of me. But you know. Hey, you're insects. Why are you going inside the acid? Good you games, man. They got. They... You know what? These patterns are actually pretty cool. Yeah, no, I mean, I certainly hope so. I mean, I would take grab that health. So. Yeah, might as well. Oh. Right, yeah, you got this. You're fine. Totally got this, bro. I believe. Mm. Where the fuck do you think you're going? I just realized your shots are ricocheting off of the door. Yeah, they can go off the doors. Yeah. Oh. And then there was one. Carl, I'll come back. All right. Mr. Birdman, eat my, you know, delights. Uh, how's your, uh, how's your, how's your cooking finger, my friend? Uh, I don't know if you know. I, I, I viciously click many things in many games. I believe it. Oh, give me, give me, give me this. I deserve it. Oh, it's not over yet, buddy. <sighs> the big, no, no, pay attention. Pay attention to that. So this is not included in the original Prime. Oh, definitely not. Nope. Dr. Robotnik? Hive, Hive robot. robot. Mecha has absorbed explosive technology into its systems. This aggressive form has, is akin to other Chozo security robots, in which biological neural networks are centrally encased. This model of combat drone is commonly replicated within Galactic Federation facilities, although here it retains much of its specialization of for Wasp Hive maintenance. Uh, in case you haven't noticed, it's pretty much just uh, the bottom of it's the weakness. Uh, oh no, or that. You played fusion, right? Uh, not enough of it, unfortunately. Oh but yeah. Well, this is literally just the boss. Oh, oh 
the you know, which is nice and all. Uh, by the way, I just shot it. it, it, it yeah. Bombing boy. Ugh. You got this. Pretty sure. I think this is designed for children. <laughs> uh, <man. laughs> yeah, whatever. You're fucking dead. You're dead, Sonic. You're motherfucking dead, Sonic. God, this thing. This really thing takes a lot of hits. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I guess it's. I guess we do have the little fucking pea shooter. So I mean, yeah, like, and you don't have like a charge shot or anything. Nothing, dude. My nothing. damage output's like poopy. Oh, big health. Hey, it's like nothing happened. Look at me go, mom. Oh no, they're not stuck. Oh, it's dead. Explosion. Wait, where are you going? Come back. Back, back to where you come can. back though. Nice. Bum, bum, bum. Right, right click, click to fire missiles. Oh, he, oh wait, right, right, yeah, we, yeah. Have, we have ammo. Yeah, I was like, what are you doing? <laughs> yeah, you're right. Oh, shit. What? Oh, I yeah. didn't scan the energy tank. No, my yeah. completion's ruined. What the hell is this? Yeah, what is that? A uh, rift in space and time is preventing Don't touch target. it. Oh, it's the, it's the end of the game. Yeah, don't touch it. All right, let's go back and grab the rest of our power-ups. Let's go grab the morph ball. It just broke. Uh, just stuff. All right, uh, whatever. Oh, dude, I didn't notice. Do you see the giant Chozo statue in the background? I didn't, but it's cool. we'll, 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 I'll, I'll see it when we go back. Yeah, to end this. Yeah, I got the little extra thing. You know what? Oh, wow, you have to fire multiples? Not worth Yeah. Uh, no, 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 no. Going back to the morph ball, though. You're going the wrong way. This is the map station. Isn't it? Yep. You don't want that. You have a map on the top right of your screen. I understand. Boy. I understand. Hello. Oh, oh. Wow. The fact that I'm like getting flashbacks to, to playing my, uh, Game my GameCube and uh, <laughs> realizing where I am via a two, you know, a two D design is um, uh, is like hitting me. It's one of those things where it's just like. This is definitely like edited to like with the idea of like obviously this is a demo because mm -hmm. like none of this is like super accurate right there. You gotta jump on that. Oh, ha! I didn't scan the morph. No, I think uh, I scanned it last time anyway. Press S yes. to kneel, and then we just do that. I don't got bombs yet though. No, you do not. But I can sneak through places now. This. But yeah, I still but, don't have but you don't have bombs, though. <laughs> uh, it's like, so what good are you if you can't fucking fire your bombs? Uh, can you press start or anything? Ash is a block. The material is the purpose of known weapon systems. A sticky note is attached to which states under construction. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, sharp contrast in surface bark patterns on this tree indicates rapid infection. At the cambium layer, uh, regions with the most advanced decomposition are primarily at the extremities. These diseased limbs and roots may lack structural integrity. It can uh, break. Yeah, is there a way you can like press start? Oh, okay. Yeah, all right. That's what I wanted to see. Map. That's actually perfect. That's literally all I wanted uh, to see. So, oh, ooh. ooh, that art though. We've unlocked the missile launcher. We got the power beam. Combat scanner on that. Power grip. That's really fucking cool. Let me have that. Oh, what the hell? Oh, shit. This is just, just to show, just show what, we, uh, what we can find. And then back to map is just to the right. That's pretty dope. All right. Uh... So why Nintendo not paying these people? They clearly are doing a better job than they are right now. But they don't want to admit that. Oh, oh too much pride. Um, so what? Um... I think the only thing we can do now is just go back and collect a few of the metal upgrades, and that's about it. Dang. All right. Well, I guess we can end this up. This is a if this is a proof of concept, like they they fucking hit it out the bucking ballpark. That's for damn sure. You know. Damn. <laughs> it never stood a chance. <laughs> Oof, bruh. <laughs> <laughs> No. No. Jim Bob Steve and Jim Bob Joe, I need you guys to leave me alone. 
Especially you, Jim Bob Joe. Uh, I mean, man, I really love me some Metroid. And uh, given that we have the dolphin or whatever, we're probably gonna be doing something um something in the wings. This has whet my appetite for fucking Metroid. I will say this, uh, you know, for for somebody who does play on PC, the keyboard and mouse controls are like fucking actually incredible. <laughs> I'm actually surprised. No, like, I played sure, so I'm many sure. games where this is just not even like it's like not even possible. And like, these guys have like made it feel literally seamless. Like I'm sure it feels fine, but like since no. I don't own a PC, yeah. <laughs> a game by Team Skew. You guys did a great job. Oh, they got their, their avatars. The 92% of the fucking Metroid thing is kind of funny. Matthew Griffin. Tro oh, Troy92. I see. So that's like his uh, his tag or whatever. Yeah. The, uh, dude, your sound design's fucking 10 out of 10. Oh, he's also the animator, too. So this Christ. shit's like... Uh, that's actually fucking nuts. The UI designer. Artists. That's cool. There's, There's only four people? Like four people? Four people. Yeah. That's incredible. Once again, four people for a proof of concept. Uh, yeah. Oh, he's the environmental artist. So he does all the backgrounds. That's the, that's the so shorter bird. Yeah, shorter bird. Shorter bird. And then soundtrack. But uh, yeah. That's really uh, that's a really good proof of concept. Uh, this is still currently up. If I can, if the link's acting. still work, you know, workable, I'll leave it down below for people who have not tried this out. Um, once again, as you saw, it's like really short. If you wanted to speed run this, this thing takes like 20, 22 minutes. Honestly, it, it, it can take less than that. Yeah, if you just don't ignore like what's called. Yeah, I, Wait, I, there's there's an actual what? There's an actual percentage. <laughs> uh, so we're only in this for 18 minutes, but even so, like there's. Yeah, it's, you know, just even for. Uh... <laughs> OK, so now I'm, I'm now I'm curious as to what the fuck happens if you collect everything. Probably nothing. Probably not. Probably yeah, not. Once yeah, again, there's not a lot yeah. that that's done because once again, this is a, just simply a demo. Well, but just like you know, the original Metroid Prime demo, like that, that dude, that's that whets your appetite. You yeah. know, Metroid Prime's demo was like one of the best things about the GC. You know, the the GameCube had so many awesome demos, and I mean, I I do miss game demos a lot. I mean, I guess the modern version of that is early access. Well, I mean, some games, certain games, yeah, still, some games do have demos. You yeah, know certain I mean? games like, still do have demos, but they're they're not like demo builds. They're literally like. It's technically the full game that's set on rails that ends at a certain point. Uh, the programming of it, as opposed to uh, how like old demos didn't use the function. The last game I played that had a demo, but it it was weird because it was it was timed. Yep, that's typically the way I, I know um, that they go about it. And uh, it was for uh, East Nine Monstrum Knox. Uh, essentially, you got to play two different different dungeons. Mm -hmm. from a part of the game and you got like 15 minutes to complete them okay yeah but uh once again i i'm happy with this this was uh this no, was really it's cool. dope don't get me wrong it's dope I'm glad that Just... i got to hear about it stream you know, i'll it from like a game radar sort of article so yeah check this out for yourself i'll hopefully give you guys the link to the in the description um so you guys can try this out yourselves and, as long uh, as it doesn't get taken down by nintendo you know it's just one of those things that, if, that is unfortunately does, a factoid and if it does happen say it fuck you nintendo I'll say yeah. it. Yeah, say it again. Fuck, Fuck Nintendo. you, Nintendo. Fuck you. Yeah. Until then, though, guys. Bye bye. And uh, stay tuned to possible more Metroid games in the future. Yeah, for sure. He, he's been he's been one. jonesing really bad. <laughs> I, I, I'm I'm I, I wouldn't. Can I call this a speed run? I mean, technically, yeah. You said you're gonna beat it in like one go. I could beat it in like in an hour and a half, maybe two. Want to do a long play with them? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Well, <laughs> take care, guys.